Great field assembled here for race six, Atlantic Sire Stakes, two-year-old Colts, A division advance. We honored the late uh, Boy McDonald tonight. I think we're all on board the two here, Little Leroy. Oh, and he's got a big time shot at it too. And what a, as I quote his son-in-law, Danny Kurt, a giant, and I mean a giant in island harness racing. It's the third division of the Atlantic Sire Stakes here in the sixth. Rockin' your boots, Little Leroy. Marigo Magic, Dusty Lane Tito, Jackie's boy, post time. Drop and pacing, Marigo Magic, Jackie's boy, little Leroy, the third one into the turn. To get away, fourth, rocking your boots, and on the outside, Dusty Lane Tito, as they arrive at the opening gate, it's Marigo Magic and Murner the leader. From the outside, second, Jackie's boy now drops into the rail. Racing from third is little Leroy. Now fourth, along the inside is Dusty Lane Tito, trailing the field, rocking your boots fifth on by the opening quarter mile and Marigo Magic the fraction setter 28 four open it up Jackie's boy races from second around the turn third that is little Leroy fourth up the rail is Dusty Lane Tito trailing the field rocking your boots fifth and down the stretch they come the half mile is the next station and Marigo Magic is the midway point leader for Adam Murner. Jackie's boy races from second, little Leroy third, then in fourth. That is Dusty Lane Tito and trailing the field along the inside. That's rocking your boots. 59 seconds flat for an opening half mile. By the five eights they go and on the lead, Marigo Magic from the outside. Here's little Leroy now to pick up second. Third up the rail. Jackie's boy Dusty Lane Tito continues fourth and trailing the field. That is a rock in your boots. Three quarters. That goes to Marigo Magic. Second on the outside is little Leroy. Third along the inside. Jackie's boy. Three quarters and one. 29 flat. They're turning for home. Marigo Magic looking to close it out. Jackie's boy second. Dusty Lane Tito coming up the inside third on the wire. Marigo Magic in the Sire Stakes for Adam Murner. Jackie's boy second. Dusty Lane Tito third. Time for the mile. 156. 3. 27 and 3. Closing quarter. All right, we're going to get a look at the uh, sixth race slow-mo replay brought to you by Universal Media. It was Atlantic Sire Stakes, two-year-old Colt, A Division, Marigo Magic, and Murner. They got all the respect here tonight, Kent. Yeah, and uh, got away with an easy pace here. Uh, went back to the front, changed tactics, and no second-itis tonight for Marigo Magic. 28-4, 59-129. Here comes little Leroy on the outside. Rebuffed, got the cold shoulder at eight to five. Marigo Magic by Tobago Case for Adam Murner. Melissa Rennie, second career victory, and by far a new lifetime mark. Sprints home 27 and three. Pocket setting Jackie's boy. Settles for second, Dusty Lane Tito third. Marigo Magic with a sparkling new mark of 156 and three in the sixth. Atlantic Sire Stakes.
Ladies and gentlemen, the Gold Cup and Soxer starter shirts, they're available at the Photo Souvenir booth. Better get them while they're here because they're not going to last long. They're a classic, and it could be the all-time magnificent mile at Charlottetown. Here comes Saturday night. So the starter shirts for the Gold Cup and Saucer number 64 available at the photo souvenir booth. Now arriving at the sixth race winner's circle, number four is Marigo Magic. Bay Pacing Gelding, the two-year-old son of Tobago Cage, is off the Largo Dam, Meridian Magic. Owned by Mike May, Herman McQuaid, Derek Cameron, and Ian Walker. Bred by Barry and Reuben Martin of Nova Scotia. Trained by Melissa Rennie. Driven to victory by Adam Murder. And the Colt makes every call a winning one. Stepping to a new race win record of 156 and 3 with a closing panel 27 and 3. Marigo Magic in the Atlantic Sire Stakes. <laughs> 